you know what to say. Who wants to intro? Bam, 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 bam. The way you carried on was brilliant. <laughs> right, lads, um, we've, uh, we've, we've convened here today <laughs> to um, kickstart a little something that we want to call That Peacock's Podcast. I feel like copyright infringement might... Uh, I'm going to be honest know. with you, Josh. I, I hear what you're saying. <laughs> I hear what you're saying, but I don't think that Peter Crouch or his team are going to give a shit. <laughs> they know who we are. They're, no. they're not going to care who we are. That was a bit on PG. <laughs> I'll apologise now. Um, so who are we? Go, Who Jake. are we? I, I'm, I'm Jake Crump. I'm uh, pleased to say I'm, I'm chief of TikTok. Chief of TikTok. Here, uh, at Talk Town, recently promoted from sort of person that turns up to games and says they're involved with the media team to chief of TikTok. So that's, that's me. That's a role that's gone quite, you know, quickly. You, you've advanced in that role fairly, fairly quickly. Yeah, I, I'd say so. It was um, probably one of the easier promotions I've ever had in my life. <laughs> <laughs> but, but one that I can look back on and be most proud mm. of, I think. Um, to the, to the, <laughs> for the audio, I'm looking at my hands to figure out what's left and right. To the right of me is uh, Dan Howe. Introduce yourself, boy. I'm Dan Howe. I've been here a while. I've <laughs> <laughs> been here a while. <laughs> I haven't left yet. I just, I just write the tweets. Is that's that not, it? That's not, that's not all you do. Just get a bit excited every now and then. Yeah. And what's your, your, your sort of Post yourself in your graphics. Yeah, there's a big one today of, uh, of Lewin Turn I in off the outside of the boot. That was a special moment. That, that was good, yeah. Uh, you just try to get excited in words, really. You do a good job. I, yeah. Often when I'm looking at TikTok, TikTok, sorry, I just... I'm You've got TikTok on the brain. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's got TikTok on the yeah, mind. You know, when I'm looking at Twitter, I, I see somebody's name in capitals. I can just imagine you screaming it at your little... Um, it's normally about three... It's normally about 30 seconds after I've ran down the touchline somewhere <laughs> and then go, oh, oh shit, oh, oh no. Spilled your pint whilst running. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, I better tweet out the goal. Mm. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, it's very good. And to my, um, do I need to look at my hands? I mean, you can if you need to. I promise, I don't know my left and right. Well, it, it, it's more ahead of me. Uh, to my right, please introduce yourself. Uh, Josh Perkins, I... I don't really know what I do here. Um, I film a lot of games and I'm the blo- basically the, bo- the bloke who talks to Rob um, after every game. That's me. He is um, our voice. I think you should be, your title should be Chief of Interviewing Rob Gray. <laughs> Chief, just the voice. Well, that's the what voice. I was called yeah. the voice. I was Josh Perkins, the voice. Uh, yeah, well, in a, in a previous life, I was the voice of, <clears throat> excuse me, the, the Peacocks podcast a few seasons ago. So there you go. That, You're going to be our me. chief here. Uh, hardly. Uh, I've been here, well, I've not been in the, the least amount of time, but. I mean, no, for, yeah. I meant for the podcast, you've got to be the chief. Should, okay. we, take, should we take a vote? <clears throat> of what? Uh, if you should be the um, chief of podcast. Well, it's two against one, so. That's the idea of a vote, <laughs> That's democracy. There's only seven votes. Yeah? We've got right. some guests. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, what's he going for? I went for the uh, you can have a doggy bag if you want. <laughs> uh, I've already sorted that out, don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm the king of doggy bags yeah, as well as king of shit. No, <laughs> I, I don't drink. Pepsi Max, so, anyone? That's alright. Like, is it hard or no? That was a uh, <laughs> brief was cameo. A brief cameo from, from Kev Um Chief of being a chairman. <laughs> he is a chairman. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, the man and sometimes the kids. Man. <laughs> yeah, and he does do the kids sometimes. He does a lot. He's a man who hates a number eight. He does. Coincidentally, number eight got set off today, didn't he? <laughs> that's true, that's true. It must have been a fantastic day for Sturdy. <laughs> he's, he's had a great day. He's a big fan of Tom Grennan and number eight got sent off. What was your answer? Yeah. Goodness me. Yeah, well, okay. I'm so. Gonna, I'm going to interject really quickly. Go on. Kept is boiled. Who wants a cuppa? Oh, yes, please. Oh, okay, okay. White one. White and Cheers. White. So Josh, we've got to explain really why what are we doing? We are waffling on. Yeah. This really is sort of reigniting what you started. A little bit. Um, we started, what was this, two seasons ago potentially, the, uh, the a-, a Peacocks podcast. We had, you know, two or three guests, be it players, management, staff, volunteers um, that, that came onto the podcast and, and told them a little bit, told, you know, the, the, the listeners a little bit about what they did. 
Um, so we're almost, as you say, revitalising that, bringing it to 2021-22 season, um, starting with a preview of us three. The media team, uh, who do we hope to have on in the next few weeks, coming months, whatever? Hopefully players. Yeah, I mean, Rob Dre would be top of the list. Yeah, he was our, he was our first one last time, I believe it was Rob. As long as you don't get the sack. Are you, for, are you foreboding something, no, Is there something we don't know? No. No, of Mind not. Mind you, if you look at it, as I am head of uh, Chief of Tweets, <laughs> I, mean, I do enjoy it. You could just tweet, Rob Ray's been sacked. I yeah. could. There is a... T- but I wouldn't. I wouldn't recommend <laughs> you it. I job. wouldn't be on the next podcast. No. <laughs> I'm going to set the scene for you. Go on. Jake Crump is currently making some brews. So, I've had an accident. <laughs> oh, <laughs> There Jake Crump is the runner of this podcast. And I put water in it, and yeah. I realised, this is Josh's tea here. I don't know, it's some phantom tea cup. So, uh, you've got a cup of tea, mate. Sit down. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> cheers. Oh. You take sugar. Uh, yeah, just the one, please. Just the one. Jake is also the runner in, in the, the media team, it seems. Chief of the kettle. Chief of coffee. Chief of tea and <laughs> coffee. Yeah. Uh, um, what other things do we hope to bring to... I mean, obviously, Chief of TikTok. Uh, Jake is in his new role has, has found a way to... Um, well, he's found a way to somehow get food in the podcast, uh, in, in, the, um, in, the, in the TikToks, which is something that he, well, is a, is a big fan of, he, uh, Jake. He, uh, any, I think just any opportunity... Food comes into yeah, it yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he sort of had five minutes um, before the game, and he was like, "So you want to do some face to camera stuff?" Yeah, all right, fine. So there's the TikTok that Jacob uploaded. It is out now. On, uh, <coughs> it is Taunton FC on TikTok. TikTok.com forward slash at Taunton Town FC. Um, Jake, I may have glanced over. Thank you very much for the tea, by the way, mate. Here we go, boys. Thank you. Oh, question. Go on. You put the milk in first, didn't you? No, I didn't put the milk in first. I'm not a monster. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I saw. <clears throat> I thought I saw you putting the milk in first. So I just wanted to clear a few things up. I think the great thing about this podcast is some people are sitting there and think, "What on earth are these three chaps doing, sat around the table, waffling?" And I feel like it's a way of us sort of giving it an insight. Mm. You know, we're going to have guests on. Yeah. Have us chatting random stuff. Yeah. Yeah. About Taunton. I mean, that's what I do. That's my daily job, mate. I, I do that on a... Hello. Um, you're right. All right, yeah. Um, Kev said to come back. Oh, yeah. Come back. Come back. Come back. Here. We, we are in the buffet. This the is the best bit about starting a podcast. Is <laughs> we, don't have a, we don't have a home for it. So we sort of come into the suite. The people where, suite. Where all the uh, important people come. Taking their table. Uh, but there is food left over. So a lot of the volunteers are coming in and out. Like we are. I've got, I've got a bit of brownie, I've got a little goodie bag, I've got a tuna sandwich and a sausage roll to take home. Is that all you do, do you, you know, do you not manage to feed yourself when you're at home? Is that Well, I mean I probably will. Yeah. But I'm <laughs> never gonna say good no. I don't know, there's a tech there if you want one. Yeah. What about the food for like I might actually get into one at one point. Um, if, if one of our podcasts is going quite well, the Guinness is there. I mean the Pepsi Max is eyeing me up currently, so probably boys. Well, there's no southern comfort. There's no southern comfort. Kind of man, eh? do you you tell, yeah, do you want to tell us on, that story? Tell the story. I don't think there's much of a story to it. Oh, there is. We were coming home from Hayes and Yedin, and we stopped off at Fleet Services, mm. and I grabbed a can of southern comfort lime and lemonade, and that seems to be sort of I just, a it, running joke. It set a precedent because it was the first game of the season. Then, you know, quick stop off uh, on the, along the M3, and... I mean, you know, you, you you have your Jimmy Whiz and stuff and, you know, head, head back on the road, I guess, but... <laughs> Can't be what, sorry? <laughs> Nothing. Your Jimmy Whiz. Mm. Interesting. Mm. Well, I mean, we, watching Taunton this season on the road hasn't been the most enthralling. It's been... Um, Mainly because... The problem is we haven't gone anywhere other than Western. <laughs> That's, yes. I mean, yeah. back to winning ways today. Yeah. Fantastic results some good... Uh, 500 through the gate. You can't go wrong there, really. Um, no. And back home again next week. Yeah. And playing uh, no midweek games, which actually is quite a blessing in the side. Definitely. 2 1 against Gospel. I mean, 2 1 against second place is. Mm-hmm. That's. Yeah, like. It's a big dub. It is. It is a big dub. And in the interview with Rob, um, he's still not 100% happy. And I think that's testament to, uh, you know, the manager that he is, um, winning a- against a second place side. To then come out of that and still think that you maybe lacked 
um, some key performances. Yeah, obviously, we've got a few injuries. We know with Zach Smith and um, Dan Sullivan and Ollie Chamberlain, who are due to be in next week, he's told me. Um, uh, but as you say, we're, we're again at home. Are we on... doing a little exclusives on this podcast now? Uh, well, well, I think the interview would have been out by now. <laughs> it's true. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah. the problem with this pre-recorded stuff. He's too focused on that brownie right now, I'll be honest. Yeah. Gosh. I mean, how was that? I mean, we've done a few food reviews. On food this reviews. Now. I mean, how was that brownie for you? <laughs> that brownie was somewhere in between a brownie you'd buy as part of a meal deal and a brownie you'd make yourself. Yeah. Which was quite a good one then. It was... Stodgy. Listen, it... Listen. You know, we, will, we will have an exclusive here. Well, I don't like cake. <laughs> so why have you had one? Do yeah, you know? what, what, this is what I want to know. What was your main? That was like your main thing. Is you went to the tray in the people suite and picked up, picked you out set, the brownie. You set the scene here. You've sort of glanced across the buffet table. <laughs> I have yet yeah. a vast um, selection, shall we say, of sandwiches, sausage rolls, a couple of Carlsbergs as mm. well, some yeah. cake. But you've chosen a brownie. Mm. Well, a brownie mm. is the least cake-like cake. You're not wrong. <laughs> so I thought, <laughs> I don't like cake, but I feel something, you know, nice and windy today. I'm going to treat myself, something a bit sweet. So You're going to treat yourself cube. to something you don't like. I had a sugar cube. I reckon <laughs> if I hadn't eaten that sugar cube <clears throat> before having the brownie, the brownie would have been better. There is another exclusive. Jake eats um, sugar uh, fruits. Whoa, 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 whoa. Listen, let's not phrase it like that. <laughs> you do, you, you took a sugar I cube from the bowl. I don't eat sugar cubes. What do you do? I'm not a horse. <laughs> <laughs> but if there's horse. a bowl, yeah. <laughs> if if there's a bowl of unattended sugar cubes, I might pinch one. <laughs> it's sort of there's other food yeah, tubes you know, there for probably, taking. You know, it's sort of you, like I said. I want to treat myself to something sweet. <laughs> don't really like cakes. I didn't see the brownies at this point. Sugar cubes. As sweet as anything. It's a bit crunchy. Yeah. And then at the end of the day, you can get shouted at by your dentist. <laughs> uh, but no, we, we're waffling here. We yeah. are. We're, we've gone a little bit off, uh, I off think the pace. Ninety-five percent of the people have clicked off now. For the five. If you haven't clicked off, uh, comment, Dan. You're a uh, Twitter man. Twitter man. Dan, the, Dan, the Twitter Dan, man. The Twitter man. There you go. That's comment what that. Channel. <laughs> Um, but that's been a little bit of a preview. <laughs> we've, we've, uh, well, what have we established? That Jake's the chief of TikTok, Wait, yeah. uh, Dan does the tweets, and I do the filming. So that's been us on that Peacock's podcast. We're going to have guests, we're going to have laughs, we're going to have cups of tea, maybe a tech least. And I'm going to throw something into the mix here. Go on. We're going to have a sponsor, and that sponsor's going to be the, um, the junior thing. Someone help me out here. <laughs> junior Peacocks. The Junior Peacocks. Junior Peacocks. Yeah, what do you know about the Junior Peacocks, Dan? Well, five pounds. Five pounds. You get some fantastic opportunities. You do. I you do get to meet the players before the game. I mean, I can, I can, you know, as our podcast. As, as Dan Dan, the Twitter man. As the podcast sponsor, I should really give them a, a good bit of promo. Track. Yeah. If there's one thing I'd have always wanted growing up, it would be a welcome letter mm. from Rob Drake. Town's manager, specifically <laughs> Rob Drake. And that's something you can get if, uh, if you're of, see, 14 or under. Going back, to, it's funny when players sign for a club, how often they say, I wanted to be there since I was five years old. Mm. Now, I'll be honest, at five years old, I didn't know what a Taunton Town was. But I know one thing, I wanted a letter from Rob Gray. Now that's one... <laughs> 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 that's Let me explain. <laughs> Mother. <coughs> Mother. No, 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 I don't want a Skeletrix. I wanted a letter. <laughs> I want a right. letter from Rob Drake for Christmas. Well, Sorry. I mean, for just £5, you get a free gift a TTFC water bottle or a gym sack. <laughs> don't get me wrong, I thought, and a welcome letter from Rob Drake. Now, it's a fantastic, and I mean, the, what the club has done uh, revolutionised, shall I say, the merchandise that, that Taunton Town have on offer. Yeah, and Rob have done a great job. Um, and I mean, it gives it a, a fantastic... Um, it's a round of applause for the club shop. A mm. fantastic opportunity for the juniors to get involved with Taunton Town, and obviously with it being the future of our club, as far as um, supporter base, um, even players, you know, we've got the Youth, um, youth Trust now, um, with some fantastic players coming up through the ranks. 
um, and hopefully onto the first team at some point. Um, but I mean, you get a free activity sheet at each home game um, and an opportunity to win gift vouchers for the club shop as well and opportunities to meet the players. I mean, who wouldn't want to meet the players after a win like today? Exactly. So, you know, Jared Lewington. Lewington! The guy <laughs> in off the other side of his feet. You're going to want to meet him. Now, if you're 0 to 14 years old, you can get that opportunity for a fiver. I've never been so upset to not be 0 to 14 years old. <laughs> See, five-year-old me that didn't want the scale electrics. Yeah. just wanted that letter from Rob Drake. Coming up to Christmas as well. Yeah. Fantastic Don't know, don't, don't know what to get your kids to stick in their stocking. A letter from Rob Drake. That'll go down the tree. That would be a Christmas miracle. The tractor is currently going around the... Uh, the ground. Yeah. It did sound like a, a train pulling into a station there. <laughs> it, it did for a second. But, uh, <laughs> I thought we were... Uh, Torn train station. I thought yeah. we suddenly changed location <laughs> But I mean, we, we are waffling now. We, we, we are, are waffling again. I we were waffling at the start, but this is just... Uh, we're going to have guests. We're going to have fun. We're going to have laughs. We're going to have very random um, stories that go off topic very long ways. Um, but hopefully you enjoy it, really. That's the main thing. Uh, just to give you something that gives you a, an extra in- insight something to listen to when you're on your commute when mm. you're trying to not do anything but work that's true um, if you do want any questions sent in uh, for the podcast obviously media at tauntontown.com would be the best place to send it absolutely um, and if you've got suggestions of what we can talk about or guests you want on in particular to start with um, and we'll get that sorted for you sorted that is that Peacock's podcast Jake you have one last thing I was going to say what I would like for mm. people that are listening to the podcast is uh, to you that email address. I would like to know just the worst thing that's happened to you on a Taunton Town away day. Why the worst? Why are we starting why negative? Worst, yeah. Why the worst? Can we well, go with the best? It's funny. It's funny. Yeah. It's, it's funny. Fun, We're going to your story. best worst stories. Yeah, your best worst stories. Have you, I don't know, you've, you've gone all the way to London mm. and you've accidentally realised you've gone on the wrong week. And we're playing at home. Okay. Ah, I see. I, wanna, I don't want to know. I, I went to London to go and watch Short Town play and I got stabbed and ended up in intensive care. <laughs> Half of, like, that's not the sort of worst thing. Oh, okay. So something where it's gone terribly wrong. Something has gone awfully wrong, but not see, awfully awful. Yeah, yeah. What I've got for an example is we played basketball um, the year we got promoted. Um, we made it all the way to Tiverton. Um, it, it doesn't sound far, I suppose, from talking <laughs> But for me, it's probably about an hour, hour 20. Yeah. Just to be told. It was snowing on a Tuesday night, and we got turned back to game called off. Now, I spent three hours driving yeah. in some snow. I can imagine you were a little bit peeved to hear we that. Just be off. But that's just an example of what, you know, we might talk about next week. We, we might have a guest on. We might have a guest on. There's a lot of mites. There's um, a lot of mites going on. This is, if, if you like, I think the best way to describe what this podcast is going to start off like is going to be, it's a little bit, look, help. Yes. It's going to be a little bit of an audio car crash. Yeah. You're not going to want to look, you're not going to want to listen, but you're not going to be able to help yourself. That's true. Because there's just something going on that makes you think, oh, I've got to, I've got to keep listening. I've got to listening. keep listening. But that is, wise. that's what it's going to be. And I think it is time to wrap up before we do. So right. There's the preview. I mean, that's the preview, yeah. Should we just clip that bit out? No. We just keep going. Because that's what the Peacock, that Peacock's podcast is all that about. That Peacock's podcast is it's all about. It's that we keep going. Anyway, Jake from uh, the chief of, chief of TikTok, Dan, chief of tweets, uh, and from Josh, the chief of um, mm, that this? being uh, Rob Dre's um, talking man too. <laughs> that's the end. That's the Something end. Like that. Anyway, thank you very much. Cheers, and I'll see you next week. Bye now, bye, bye, bye. <laughs> <laughs>